Yo, what is going on boys, Asian Sensation, back with another banger. Today's episode, we got some baby calcium boost only. Let's get it. All right, so we're going to try out some NG Farm SPAC. I kind of want to just do some Spike Factory Micro because it's fun, dude. Um, I don't really know the anti-stall NG spot. I think it's like right here. So we're just going to rock with this and then get after it. But yeah, man, if you guys are new to the channel or just haven't done so already, make sure to hit that subscribe button for us as well. It helps out the channel immensely and gets us closer and closer to hit our goal of 100,000 subs. Alrighty. Let's see. How do I want to play this? He has Dartling. Okay, start off with a Dartling. I don't know why. And he accidentally bought um, Focus Barrel Spin. He accidentally got the thing that makes it so his Dartling's like spread isn't as wide, which is interesting and definitely accidental. So it feels bad for him, but he's going to go for a farm here momentarily, I would imagine. I should probably be rushing because he doesn't have Powder Arts up yet, huh? But. Yeah, we're trying to farm SPAC, very micro heavy loadout because I think it's fun to just micro the Spike Storm. I don't know. I don't really use Spike Factory much at all. That's probably, if you watch all my videos of all time, it might be my least used tower. Like there's a slim chance that, oh, there's a decent chance that it is. I feel like it would just make sense. Also, we're just going to put this on last so that it anti-stalls. I don't know if it actually will, but the goal is to anti-stall. We want these rounds short, short, short because we lose to... Almost all Darling loadouts late game. If he has like Darling Farm Boomer for some reason, sure, we beat that late game. But if he has a normal strat like he most likely does, of uh, something like Darling Farm Bomb or Glue or Ice, probably it's probably Glue though, we get destroyed late game. So we don't want this to go late. We want these rounds short, which is why we anti-stall. I'm, I'm only going to say it so many times, chat. So he's going to want to get his plantation up momentarily. He can probably afford it at 142 game time if I had to guess. So because of that, we're going to try to aggro here. I don't really have much money though yeah so he gets up his farm 142. i don't think i can really aggro and have this do anything though i feel like i don't have enough monies but he does have glue and we get a tower boost out of him he did not need that tower boost but he boosts at like 150 so if somehow we make it to around eight before like 220 then we can bloom boost yellows because he won't have a boost for 30 seconds since he last boosted but he likely will have his boost back by then because it's around seven so long now, I can afford a farm right now, but I'm not going to because I'd rather just send him like a billion yellows and get a second boost. Yeah, now we just go for a second boost here. If he rushes me, it's fine. I'm going to get Niner, actually. He sells a farm. Wow. And he still has to boost here if he doesn't get... Yeah, you still have to boost. Sorry, dude. You still have to boost. Still have to boost. There it is. All right, so he's down to one boost. Now, I went really aggro, so I have like no money. But now we have to start saving up for our trap. We've done the good job of you know we haven't really done an amazing job of anti storm but we've done a good job of forcing defense we've gotten two boosts out of him we're just gonna instant tower boost this by the way if he wants to send me infinite yellows go ahead but all right we're good we have all our spikes as well he only has one plantation probably 300 eco not good at all if he sends me a massive round 11 rush are we able to afford a balloon tr okay he's gonna go for a massive round 10 rush all right. I mean, this shouldn't really do much. We can burn a spike if we really need to. Yes, we will. We can sell sell for our balloon trap if he rushes again here. Yeah, he's going to rush. So we're just going to balloon trap up right away. And this is going to be free money. So I got him. Give me the monies. Assuming nothing gets by. Mm, some stuff got by, but we can go for our spike factory boy now. And send him a camo lead. This is in our favor for sure. Because if he doesn't get like a bank or a somewhat early BIA, he just loses late game. So this is completely fine with me. If he all outs right now, by the way, uh, I might die. I don't think I can afford double trap. If I get double trap, I'm fine. But let's see. We can sell that for like 4k. Yeah, it's close to affording. Ah, we're pretty dang close. I'm just going to farm on here though. As soon as he goes for... Okay, he went for his plantation. So now we rush him and go for a nasty layer here. But I don't really have much money to rush with. But honestly, like these yellows should just overwhelm over the top. Just kind of okay, selling farms. Bro is literally just vibing to the sell a farm by Lucian right now because that's all he's been doing. Unfortunately for him, not a good look for Zero Hero Man. So uh, kind of showing his amateur self here, and now he's sad because bad feels bad, man. It is it, it is what it is. Like <laughs> that's kind of what happens when you're just not the greatest at the game. You know what I mean? Like this guy just he's just inexperienced is all, and it happens. And he's getting exploited by all my rushes, but it's fine. Usually these type of players love sending like group camo leads. I wouldn't be surprised if we see that. He needs to get up a bank ASAP. Honestly, it might just be too late for him. We'll see though. Is he going to rush right here? 
Rushing gear is not a bad idea. I think I just save up for my spike balls now. But just having the balloon trap money is just so nice here. I don't even think we go for a BIA here, right? We just farm. So now I'm just going to save up for my spike balls. I have two spikes. He's going to... Oh, he, sent... he went for a round 16 bank. Okay. So how do we beat round 16 bank? We probably just send him... Also, I think spike balls should be a little cheaper. Call me crazy, but I think like 2200 would be a good balance change. Anyways, um, so we're going to send a Moab with a ton of stuff behind it, like layered stuff. Ah, uh, yeah, because I think we should be able to pierce cap. Like his darling's not going to be able to clean up everything. Also, leads are kind of a bad rush, but we're going to send some camos behind it. It's going to be really deadly. Thasmacia, he's just going to use his last boost here, I'd imagine. I'm not even going to bother sending camos, I lied. Because he's just going to boost here, I think. Right? I'm also fine just getting eco here. I'm trying to just block his darling from hitting the Moab. And I think he's dead. Yeah, you're dead. GG. Wait. Yeah, GG. It kind of looked like he defended. But I honestly think sending those pinks just blocked his darlings from hitting the Moab. GG, man. GG, no re... All right, now we got Z2. I think this is Zero2, who's actually one of the better heli players of all time. Let's see. If I follow them, it's them. Oh, I don't, but it's rank one. All right, there's my clickbait. Beautiful. All right. So we got Swan Lake here, rank one player. All right. I think we just go both for Mortar Call it a day. Good luck, have fun. He's skipping Swan Lake, one of my favorite maps. And instead, we get Hydro Dam. I mean, I'll play it. I don't, I don't like this map. Because it's always, it's like boat farm glue where you lose, basically. You can go boat farm boomer. That's like the only other viable strat, I feel like. Boat farm NG loses to boat farm glue. Yeah, it's just boat farm glue or boat farm boomer and die. So I think if he anti stalls round one, he has boat farm boomer. If he doesn't, he has boat farm glue. So good luck, have fun. Hopefully we can win this. I'm, I haven't been playing much, so hopefully I can. Okay, he has boat farm boomer, probably. Hopefully I can be on my game here. So since he's anti-stalling, we just start with the boat because you don't get any banana. What the heck? He has Cobra? That is not what I was expecting. So it's probably Boat, Cobra, Boomer. We should be able to win this. Ideally. Like, this is a matchup in our favor, I think. Why can't I fit a Farmer? Farmer? A bloody Farmer? I guess we got to go right here then. And we'll get a banana here shortly. And there's the Grape Shot Tay. So that's why you don't send round two. Sure, it doesn't anti or break his anti-stall, but it prevents us from leaking a ton, which I think is worth it. We're going to rush a little bit here, and then we're going to go for that. And we just want to try to stall these rounds out as much as we can. We're going to be sending towards the end of rounds to try to block his targeting and extend the rounds out by sending as little as possible. That's our whole game plan here. He's spiking. Let's note that he's used one spike. If he sends blues, we are going to need to get up faster shooting. So we're just going to get that up right now. And this should handle to round six, I believe. If I'm him, I'd probably mix in some pink layering while doing this. Also, ooh, we should rush a little bit here. Ah, oh, I waited too long. Dang it, I should have sent like two seconds earlier. I could maybe stall that round out. But instead, I got anti-stalled because I waited too long. So he's layering pinks like I said he should. The correct play. And by sending these pinks, we're making his Cobras hit my pink balloons and not the natural balloons. Which hopefully is going to stall these rounds out. I think I got to save my spikes in case he sends like Camgro leads or something. Let's get down a second boat. How do I want to play? I think I just play passive bank probably. I could do Mexico. We don't, the thing is we don't know what his third tower is. It's so mysterious. No idea what his third tower is. It's got to be Boomer, right? I feel like mortar is just not viable on this map. There's no good mortar like spot. I think we're okay here. I could probably milk a boost out of him round eight with yellows, but he's probably thinking the same thing. Um, we're low on lives. I'm gonna go for a farm anyways. This is very greedy. Don't recommend. But here we are, doing it anyways. And yeah, I'm just gonna boost to round eight. Big rush. Assuming we need to boost, that is. We probably do. Here comes Big Yellow Rush, imagine. Um, There it is. We're just going to see if we can defend this without boosting. Ah, uh, no, we boost. And now we counter. 
Sells a farm, probably. Cobra farm? Nope, he's just gonna boost. What is that boomer skin? I feel like I've never... Is that a new boomer skin? Why does it look so different? I feel like it looks funky. This is really greedy, but I'm gonna go for that. I think I just got too greedy here. Because leads are gonna be pain. Okay, he didn't send leads. There he goes. He sent them a little late, though. Now we gotta go glue splatter. Uh, I probably have to boost this round, don't I? Let me think. Um, never mind. He did send around 11 rush. That's good for us. I would have been in panic mode. My farms are honestly not terrible. I don't think I can send cam gross, big cam grow rushes here. But I can send a little rush. He probably sends me a cam grow red blood rush or something. Nope, we're good. Okay. Do I just send eco now? I kind of think mix eco is fine. Like, do I really need a bank? I don't think so. I think, oh, he, he's just... I don't think he affords Bionic, does he? Um, this might just be another boost. You're dead? What is happening? Is he good? He's leaking. Alright, so this should force a destroyer. He won't be able to defend this without a destroyer. Or he can boost, that works as well. So now if he rushes me, yep. Oh, this just defends. Is that camos? What is this rush? That is like one of the worst rushes I think I've ever seen. Now, can we kill this guy with an all out potentially? I don't think it's worth it though. He has turbo plus grave, grave ricochet. And he probably defends, so I think we just hold off. Kind of just turtle up. Let's fake a camo ceramic right here though. Does he fall for it? He knows my, no, he did fall for it. <laughs> you like that, buddy? You like that? I send Camelette again. I think this is fine. Like, he's losing a lot of money. And now we just eco again. And this should actually overwhelm, I think. Oh, no, he has Destroyer. We'll be fine. 600 eco, though. Not bad. I don't think he has money to, like, strong adjust us right here, either. Like, he can probably get up, like, three adjustments, maybe, for round 18. In which case, I should be fine. Let's see if he goes for it now. I expect the adjustment. Oh, nope, he definitely just sent a Moab. We'll just go Glue Hose into Destroyer. 3, 2, 1, Moab. Yep, there it is. He's Reeds. Can we just do that? And, whoops. Uh-oh. Okay, we just have the Boat Bowl this. Why do they, when do they increase the price of Boat Bowl? What the heck? It's 4,800? I thought it was always 4,500. Why stupid? What is this? Rush. Camos? I mean, I can boost it. Do I need to? This is a massive camo rush. We should just be fine. Yeah, we're fine. Odd rush, not gonna lie. Do I just mix eco here? What is the play? Like, 600 eco is not that bad. It's really not. Considering his strategy and how many camos he sent me, he can't have that high of an eco, I don't think. I'm gonna go for a puppy. Because he's not going for adjustments. He sends me a BFB, he loses a lot of eco. We're just gonna balloon rush here. This forces turbo. You're not defending without turbo. There's the turbo. And he's selling, he might be all out of me here. Okay, so now we just counter. And we just boost. Should be able to defend this on boost. He's dead. Yep, there we go, GG's. Rank one player, by the way. Rank one player, by the way! Break one player, by the way. GG. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to drop a like below. JK will play one more. He's not going to rematch, is he? You won't rematch me. You're scared. You're scared, little... Oh, he did rematch. A leaderboard grinder is rematching? That's when you know you got that clout, baby. <laughs> Good luck. He might just DC right here, though. Let's see. Um, I'm going to go... Should we try anti-stall heli here? I don't hate it. It's kind of fun. No, we're actually going to try aggro, attack, farm, mortar. Oh, he's going to skip. Okay, we're going to go round 50. He's going to leave. Watch. He's going to leave. He's going to leave. He's, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to... I'm slow rolling him. I'm going to let the timer go all the way to five seconds, and then I'm going to skip. He's going to be... He might just leave before the five seconds. I'd say that over under if he... Now, he, there's probably like a 70% chance he just leaves. 
Let's see. <laughs> and we get Zen Garden. Great, man. W way to go. Way to go. And now we get Zen Garden, man. Everyone's favorite map. Said no one ever. It's just like Heli Farm or Darling Farm Boomer here every time, right? He's gonna start with a Darling. I want to start with a farm, but Zen Garden is too difficult. So I guess we'll start with the Dartle Ting. I don't even know the Eco. Like, I never. This map's terrible. I hate it. I never play it. What am I supposed to Eco to here? Probably 254. No, 258, maybe? I don't. Like, am I supposed to go for Pow Darts here? Or. Or what? <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I think you go Pow Darts, right? Yeah. Is he green for a fall? Oh, he has Pow Darts or not? I can't tell. Because of the freaking Dartling glitch. Um, okay, we both have a pow darts up. Let's see if we get our farm same time. I I honestly would prefer this to be a stalled game instead of an anti-stall game. Because if it's like a mirrored anti-stall, I feel like it's just so many more like choke rushes. Okay, our 265 eco should work out pretty nicely here. We get farm same time. So yeah, that's fine. I think like 268 is probably the play going forward. About. Alright, so how do we win this game? I mean, it's just going to be choke rushes, right, dude? Like, I don't know. Like, how do you defend a round 20 BFB on this map? I feel like it's impossible. You gotta get, like, 400 Darlings and 400 Turbo Charges, and then you might defend. That's brutal. There's no way he pulls out something like Darling Farm Glue, right? Not if he's anti-stalling. There's no way. We just both are going to get our farms up right here. There we go. Out farming? Nope, JK. I wish. I think you send blacks now. Yeah. Yeah, the Dartling will slowly get overwhelmed here. Greens won't do anything. You don't have enough money to send me enough greens, buddy. I think you get a boomer down, though. Yeah. Um, Boomer placement. I think we go, like, right here. Make him a lefty. That should work. I think we got to be kind of careful on our live count, though, here. Do I want to upgrade? I think I should go for a farm. Oh, he's about to go for a farm. Ooh. Well, if he goes for... Mm, I'm going to try doing something here. Because I know he wants to farm right now. 100%. Not allow that. So he gets a Glaive Ricochet. Is that enough, though? You want double Glaives. Okay, I should probably... Okay, we're just, like, dying right now. I'm going to burn some spikes. AI is kind of pushing. I think I just boost round 8. He's going to send me a big rush. I oversent. That is my bad. Yeah, we just boost this. If he wants to keep sending, be my guess, but yeah, that's fine. So he's up a boost, well done. Like, the leaderboard grinders do pretty well in these drain game type situations, I feel like. That's what they're meant, that's how they, like, excel, I feel like. Or what they excel at. Okay, he's down, is that his second boost or first boost? I think that's his first. I want to go for a farm here. So greedy, but I afford my Bionic here any second now. If he does rush, it's fine. I kind of like the double boomer play on his end. I feel like it actually worked pretty well. Oh, he went for plant. What the? Oh, now we have four. Wow, that's such bad timing. We're getting out farmed. This is really bad, actually. That's okay. Not the end of the world. He's got a lot of money saved up. Nice bait. Dude, how are my... Dude, my targeting is just so bad right now. All right, send camel leads. Like we're tied in farms, we're up in eco, I'd imagine, but we're not looking the best right now. Okay, he's gonna send camos. That's just not gonna do anything, but you can try. Four to four to four. There we go. Please defend. That's an expensive rush, man. I'm okay with that. See, this is where I said like I'm okay with this being kind of drain gamey. Or not drain gamey. Passive, I guess. I, I Let's just send this. Let's see if we can bait any defense. This is literally just eco. Does he solo with that? See, like, the thing is, AI pushes at the same time. So he has to focus on two things at once. That's okay. He's gonna... S oh, dude, I forgot how annoying camo ceramics are on this map. We're 100% gonna have to deal with that. That's when... That's why he's getting up all those darlings. This is why I think... Having spikes is a valuable thing. Let's just get this down, because he's going to send camos. Yeah, that's not going to do anything, though, buddy. I am prepared for your rush. 
I do think we rush round 16 either way because it'll force defense. Like, the round 16 AI is so difficult, bro. This is always the play. You have to turbo. Ah, uh, double bionic might be good. Okay, we have a lot more eco than him. But the thing is, round 18 Moabs are not easy, especially when they're bloom boosted. And I don't like how... Okay, what is this rush? I don't like how high up this thingy is. Because the, it's just too early in the map for a turbo, I feel like. We want this lefty too? Or righty? I think righty's fine, actually. Righty's preferable. Okay, so we have to get ready for Moabs. I think he's going to triple spike a Moab right now, so I'm not going to send one yet. I assume he has spikes. Um, We're just going to play this full passive at first. Moab, 3, 2, 1. Yep, there it is. All right. A four turbo, please. All right, we're good. Is he just going to send me infinite Moabs here or what? Just do this. He's going to predict the Moab, I think. Can we just defend without turboing, by the way? Is, like, Darling spam viable? Let's see what he does here. He's going to spike. Nicely done. This is terrifying. Like, this game ends round 20, right? He sends me a BFB. Well, if I send him a BFB, can I defend all at Moab's counter? I think so. Really tough. Okay, this is just going to be terrifying. Let's see what happens. Good luck, have fun. Okay, he's just going to try all-outing me or something? Why? Why would you try all-outing Boomer? That's There's no way this works, right? I'm going to be pissed if this works. This should not work. Okay, it works somehow. Unreal, dude. Why do four... That ma This map's so hard, man. Four turbos can't even defend Moabs. Any other map that defends. Alright, he's leaving. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to drop a little subscribe.